said they should test their hypotheses to find the answer and put everything they find out in journals. Scientists observed a cat licking her feet. Elmo said, Ew, that cat tastes good. <coughs> the cat said she was cleaning her body with a tongue bath. Amazed, Abby and Elmo drew what they observed. <coughs> the happy scientists kept investigating. In the garden, they discovered a sparrow flapping around in a cloud of dust. Elmo and Abby were curious. The sparrow explained he was taking a dust bath because dust keeps his feathers clean. Scientists kept investigating. They saw an owl perched on the fence. Abby asked, Do you take baths? <laughs> to Abby's surprise, the owl said she was sunbathing right then. Sunshine cleans germs from her feathers. Abby couldn't believe it, but she had one friend on Sesame Street she was sure didn't take baths, Oscar. scientists knocked on Oscar's trash can. Oscar told them to scram. He was busy taking a mud bath. Abby and Elmo reviewed their journals. Everyone on Sesame Street takes baths in different ways, said Elmo. His hypothesis was correct. Abby was happy because by investigating, she learned new things. That's the scientific process. Abby and Elmo really were happy scientists. We're happy to explore. We'll observe that and this. We'll investigate new things. We're happy scientists. We'll ask some happy questions. Don't answers will insist. We'll learn lots of happy things. We're happy scientists. We're happy, 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 happy scientists. Suddenly, Elmo heard his mommy calling. It was time for his bath. Happy scientists take baths too, said Elmo. Goodbye. Watch the story again? No. To watch the story, touch the book. <laughs>